Hello Keto family, it's a beautiful day down here in South Louisiana. My name is Barry and I am the Cajun Keto Chef. Today we have a pretty exciting thing for y'all and that is a gluten-free keto roux. And you may have seen my other video on making a roux that wasn't gluten-free and it wasn't keto, it was low carb. But today we have something that I think you're gonna be excited about. So here are the ingredients. We only have two ingredients, and that is lupin flour, which is keto and gluten-free, and two sticks of butter. That's one cup of butter and one cup of lupin flour. So let's go ahead and hit the stove and let's rock and chop. Okay, so we're gonna start off with the two sticks of butter, and we wanna go ahead and melt those first, which shouldn't take but a couple minutes. So we're gonna go ahead and nail this one out. And after it melts pretty much all the way, then we're gonna add our lupin flour. And it's gonna take about 45 minutes to cook it because I wanna cook it on a fairly low temperature because uh, lupin flour has a tendency to wanna burn. So we wanna make sure we don't over to put too much heat on it when we're cooking the uh, roux. All right, the butter is melted. Now we're gonna add the lupin flour, one cup. And you'll notice it's gonna foam up here in a moment, which is perfectly normal. And I will turn the tip down now to almost a low temperature. And I know it's gonna take a few minutes to get it done, but I promise you, you're gonna love it. It almost has like a nutty flavor, just like a normal roux. And if you notice, it has a little bit of a, a yellow twang to it, but we're gonna knock that out and it's gonna be a dark brown color here in about 45 minutes. All right, we are getting close here. It's starting to look beautiful, and it has that nutty flavor that we really want when we make a roux. So we are getting close, and as you can see here in my hand, I have an awesome drink that Frank, the low-carb cocktail guy, made for me. It's called a Clover Club. Can you explain a little bit about this drink? Oh, yeah, real quick. It's a Prohibition era cocktail. Um, it was designed, I want to say, the 20s, 30s, um, at a club called the Clover Club. And, uh, mm. So that's kind of right, right before prohibition. So, uh -huh. you know, uh, so it's raspberry, so sugar-free raspberry syrup, zero carbs. Um, this is a spin on it. Usually, Clover Club's made with uh, gin, but we made this with JT Melic vodka instead, mm -hmm. uh, with an egg white. So you get that egg white sitting on top. Um, so you get a little bit of that froth that kind of sits in your mouth. It does. Let's the cocktail kind of linger a little bit. Absolutely. Longer. So the flavors last longer when you have an egg white on the cocktail. Right. Okay. Appreciate you doing that for me. Anyway, so in about five or 10 minutes, we are going to add the Trinity and get it rocking and chopping. <laughs> All right, it's been about 45 minutes. The roux is done. So as, as you can see, it's pretty easy. You just don't want to hit, hit it up with too much heat, but you can see the beautiful color. All right, now y'all need to stay tuned. I'm going to use this roux for my next video. It's going to be a seafood gumbo. Can't wait to have it for y'all. Love y'all all. all.